Hey guys, welcome back to another PvP Wars video. Today we are back on the Diamond Realm. Be sure to join the server, the one I play on. Anyways, today we're gonna make another mob grinder, except this one's for XP because if we do slash enchant, uh, you can get like a ton of enchantment orbs and uh, get some pretty good armor and swords and whatnot. And you can also see all the enchants by doing slash enchants and seeing all these. So retired enchants, you can't get them anymore. So these are the ones that you can get. There's next pages, all this kind of stuff. Uh, so yeah. Also, this grinder is actually gonna be public for you guys to use as well. Anyways, I've already laid out the area for my mob grinders to spawn. Now, the only thing that we have to do is place the water and get the spawners as well as the walls. This definitely isn't symmetrical, and I don't know what I did wrong. I really don't care if it's not symmetrical or not. I, I still think this is going to work, so let me just let me do this. Now, the thing that we need is a water bucket. And I says, okay, we found the water buckets. Okay, so the only thing that's unfortunate is that we have a 2x4 area. And that is because this area is like, I don't know, completely off. I can probably expand it, actually, now that I think about it by just going out a few more blocks on this way. Which I'm so lazy to, I don't really want to, but I think we're gonna, actually, you know what, I have a better idea, we're gonna, we're gonna make this our own. We're gonna keep this design, all we have to do is just break these areas right here, and I think we're just gonna make the mob spawn, like, uh, not spawn, but like, drop down into this area, and make a little pit, and, I you know, just maybe go down one more block, just like this, and then fill it up. There we go. That's what it's gonna look like. All the mobs are gonna spawn into this little area right there. Now we actually need to do the whole walls on these just because for some reason, you know, mobs don't like light and I gotta get rid of the light. Yeah, that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go like, I don't know, maybe that high. Yeah, that seems like perfect to me. There we go, the wall is completely finished now, and now we have to do the roof, which is gonna be annoying, so... KILL ME NOW! Alright guys, we are basically done. We don't really need to fill in like the whole thing just because we need an area to get in. So we're just going to leave a 4x2 gap right here just so we can get in and out. And that is it basically. We are completely done with this. Now we just have to get spawners. And by the way, if you look in the center right, I have $3.2 billion. That is mainly because this zombie pigment spawner, I've just been AFKing it like crazy and I've been making a crap ton of money. And as you guys can see, like, down here, uh, it's getting me a lot. Like, there's just, like, half a million in seconds. Well, not really seconds, but it's still making me a lot. And now onto the actual design. I believe it's something like this. It's, like, a four away from everything else, just like that, and then spawners go around it. Basically all throughout this thing. Now, for the meantime, it's not gonna look very good, nor is it gonna be very good. Also, my dog is barking. I'm sorry about that. But if I go to my PV1 right now, I already have a crap ton of spawners that I could be using right now. I have some blaze spawners, uh, some more blaze spawners, zip zombie pigment spawners, which I'll probably just use a stack for this because I actually got these from, uh, I don't even know how I, I think I just bought those. Creeper spawners, and I believe that is basically it. And now, basically, all we have to do is just place these spawners somewhere. So there we go, just, just place a stack of spawners there. Some blaze spawners right there. Some creeper spawners. Just like that, we have some mobs just sitting around doing nothing for us. There we go. Look at that. That's loot right there. Eventually, we're going to be able to get this up, but right now, uh, not looking too hot. But look at this, 256 zombie pigmen. If I go down here, I can just, like, sell all two, so, like, you know, just make some money while I'm at it. Now, I think what I'm gonna do is buy a crap ton of blaze spawners, because blaze spawners give you a lot of XP. Uh, spider spawners, I could buy some of those, as well as skeleton spawners, so let me just buy some skeleton spawners. I'm just spending all my money right now, this is not looking too hot. Uh, let's see, what else can I buy? You know, while I'm at it, I guess we'll buy some, uh, creeper spawners, and I think I'm finished now, so let me just... Let me find these blaze spawners. Let's 
deposit all of them. We have six. Oh, that's that's not a pretty. I really didn't mean to do that. We're gonna buy one blaze spawner so we can put it in. There we go. Uh, put in these zombie pigment spawners. Actually, I don't. I didn't even have any creeper spawners. Just put in all of them. Now for the skeletons. There we go. Place all that into there. We have 640 of those. 600. 67 blazes so i think we're going to be able to make some pretty good cash from this so from just what i have right here i'll just kill these right now and then sell all you know i'm making like what like it's not bad actually it's not a terrible income um i'm also going to make it like a, a warp sign here so if you guys want to come to my island and grind this for yourselves you guys are able to and i do have 500 million left so you know what we're just going to spend that all on blazes right now about three more stacks of blazes okay and let's deposit it all no it would have been beneficial if i actually had my interest pet on me because i could have bought a way more spawners but i'm not smart so um that's a big oopsies on my part but look at these skeletons man like there's four thousand of them just right here and they spawn so quickly like i can just kill these all right now i'm making so much xp also you can use this looter pet and you can like increase the mob drops i'm not sure if that's like super good but uh i'm sure people can use that to their advantage i actually have this heroic mask which actually increases the amount of xp i get so let me just put that on and with my grinding sword i'll just kill all these things right now and look at that i'm making 126k xp off like basically every kill of everything and i'm also getting a ton of heads while i'm at it and if i just do like auto tell on right now you can just like afk here and like i don't know just left click people and just get a crap ton of money now if you look in the chat we're making a crap ton of money okay well to be honest with you i don't make a lot from arrows or anything so probably wasn't the way to go getting skeletons uh i'll probably i don't know get rid of them and just get a crap ton of blaze spawners because blaze spawners seem very good and i don't know if you can upgrade these in something better yeah you can get glowstone glowstone you can actually sell for a lot of money whereas fire charges you don't really i don't even think you can sell fire charges what's up guys this is like four days like i don't even know how long it's been maybe two to three days four days i don't know but I have a robot right now. I'm actually going to be selling it to AKS who just paid me 3 million or actually 3 billion for it. And you know, I got 3 billion. I'm going to buy a lot of mob spawners with that money and hopefully get paid pretty good. So hopefully this turns out beneficial towards me. So I just gave him a robot. We just got 3 bill richer and I'm going to buy a crap ton of blaze spawners to make this a lot better. I've actually moved the spawners over to this corner right here. And as you can see, these are pretty overpowered i think i'm just gonna go for like all blazes because for one they give you money and i'm pretty sure they give the most xp so that's what i'm gonna do i'm probably gonna try and get rid of these skeleton spawners i've kind of wasted money on them but it's okay we're gonna just gonna go to the last shop right now and buy these spawners i believe yeah i have my interest put on me which gets rid of a lot of money so i can save some and here are the blaze spawners we're just gonna keep clicking until we're out and we're saving 24 million for each purchase and we just bought a crap ton so just like that deposit them all we just got like i think a thousand or something more and that all is going to blazes so this grinder is absolutely overpowered so what i can do is if i actually put on my heroic mask and make more xp you can see that i'm actually at nine million point four and i'm just gonna kill all these things and it's just gonna give me a crap ton of money I believe if I do slash XP again, I just made like 2 million from all of that, which is not bad whatsoever. And I can just do like auto sell on and it's just making me like a pretty good amount of money each time and they just keep rolling in. So I think my goal is to just get more blaze spawners because these are overpowered and it's definitely giving me a lot more than everything else. The arrows, the bones, it's giving me like 4,000 to 5,000. It's not really worth it. Look at these blaze spawners just coming in. So yeah, I just made like an easy like 200k off all this so far and uh, you know, it's just overall beneficial towards me and I'm just making a crap ton. So if I kill 1000 blazes, I'm at 12.6 million. I kill one of those and then I do it again. I just get like 150k off each kill and all that can go to slash enchants if I actually do it right. Uh, I can buy orbs. So let me just buy like all these orbs right now and I'll show you guys what happens and I just realized that I had... Oh my gosh. If you guys don't know what just happened, I had my auto sell on and they sell fireworks and that just sold. So I just basically wasted 12 million XP and 
Oopsies. But yeah, that's what we have so far. All right, guys, I think I'm gonna end off the video here. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys do want more, be sure to drop a like. But like I said earlier, we're gonna be making this public to everyone. So we're gonna make a welcome sign. And if you do slash is warp Tabor, you can actually come here and just start killing things. And I'm actually not gonna make it so you guys can like fly and see my island. You know, we're just gonna make it so you can uh, only only grind this mob spawner now i do want to mention that there are a bunch of other spawners that are better than mine but like if you want to make donations or something all of it's probably going to go towards this because i want to make this uh, a community thing so yeah all donations are appreciated to make this spawner one of the best on the server if you guys do want more be sure to drop a like though and i'll catch y'all soon later guys